I'm the real Nightbird. No, I'm the real Nightbird. I'm the real Nightbird. We shall see. folks 10 t neon prime here and we're back with another review this time we got a review on transformers rise of the beast studio series 104 nightbird and there she is we have a purple yes i'm using her katana and this is the only weapon at uh weapon that she come with uh, I wish they would have came with two katanas. It would make sense, but oh well. We know how Hasbro do. They put in the budget for more to go somewhere else where and cheap out on this, but it's okay. But for that, we have a purple dome here. We do have red for the eyes. You can see right there have red for the eyes. For that, we have little purple accents here. You can see on her back, her wings has purple accent here. We do have a translucent uh, front end here for her chest. And this is painted in like a smoke gray. We have the headlights trimmed in a gold. Um, also, we have the the spoiler kit here trimmed also in gold uh, we have here is her um, you get this light straight all right we have here we have her uh, front tassel I'm gonna call that a tassel cover her important areas also we have here on the side be her like skirting whatnot and here on the bottom we have her feet dressed up in a gold uh, paint look like there's like suspension working on it also um see on her arms we have no guy can see that there you go on her arms we have uh, uh them little spiky things <laughs> that that's uh that she uh had on the side of her arms in the movie we have pretty much a paint here on the side here um part this is going to be like part of the fender of the car all right fell over on the back side she do have a good old healthy backpack here on the back, we have the back of the car here. Um, of course, we have a wings here. Also, so you can tell that is. We have the rest of the car here on the downside here. The spoiler. And that's about it. Tail light. So you can see there the side of uh, her side with this huge backpack. And what we're going to do now is bring in main line. And so you can see the difference in the main line. Right? So main line is way, way taller, as you can see there. Um, I say if you have the main line and you can't find studio series. I don't think you'd be I think you'll be all right I really think you'll be all right because they pretty much transformed the same way only difference is up here that she has the wings versus she don't have the wings she has a split here for the chest pretty much the legs pretty much are the same the same size skirting I had it mistransformed my bad 
I was trying to do make it the soil like some wings. So she has less of a backpack than this chick right here. Um, like I said, I mean, it's each to your own. But if you have her, I don't see no need of getting her. Um, the reason I got it so I can do videos, do the videos so y'all can see the difference in them. So you have less of a backpack. Um, technically, she look, she look a little cleaner. Mainline look a whole lot cleaner to me versus her. Um, but if you do get her, the reason you would get her, I would get her for the reason for the car. Tell you the truth, and probably pop her head off and put it on her. Um, by the way, this is a custom paint job that I did myself. All right, so there you go. You know, I think this height works out better than this height. That's me personally. Um, if anything, if you still will want her, you could, you know, use her as robot mode and her as the car mode because the car mode looks really great. Um, so now let's just go over some articulation. All right, so articulation with her, her head is on a ball joint, so she can look up that high. You can see her eyes real good. She can look down, barely look down. Turn her head, cannot get a full, uh, she can get a full 360. She can get the confused look, has a shoulder to this high, bend the elbow, uh, arms can do a full 360. They high kick to there back kick to there as a can do a full Von Dom can has a knee swivel being that high also pretty much a double double knee bend due to transformation has a ankle crazy ankle pivot because due to transformation has a bicep swivel she do has a waist swivel also another articulation her wings can flap I wish they could have pegged that in make it where it stays so right now it just sits there it don't completely lock in and it's kind of aggravating once you know messing with everything then they could have gave her two katanas uh they just short change itself pretty much they short change itself all right there she go with one of her rivals bumblebee i come to kick some eyes there she is with Rhinox. All right, there she is with Core Class RC. There she is with Mainline Wheeljack. And there she is with Noah Diaz. And there she is with the Motley Crew. They do look very good together. All right, so we get down transformation. <laughs> The car looks good. Car mode looks very, very good. Very good. It can see you had a two-tone, the two-tone paint here. We had two-tone paint here versus here. And here is two-tone. All because it's on a translucent uh, plastic. Let's go over more detailing on it. What you have here, we have the nice 
uh, gold here also the gold here nice gold here all on the ground effects looks real good same here you can see here you do have head syndrome right there but right here I love how they did this where her under her chest plate was basically showing a transmission on it so that looks really really well all two areas where you can put put the katana there all right so I brought in my custom painted one so y'all can see the difference in them is a little longer then uh studio series yeah, pretty much there she is with her main line person there she is with off-road bumblebee there she is with main line optimus prime there she is with her partner in crime battle trap and there she is alongside with scourge and there they are all together so i try to capture that iconic picture of when we first seen uh what vehicles was going to be in rise of the beast so i hope i do it i did it some justice all right as far as miss uh nightbird here um like i said earlier if y'all have the main line I wouldn't worry about wasting 25 bucks on her and getting her. Um, I'll wait till she would go on sale and probably get her then. So I think my thing, I think robot mode goes to mainline, vehicle go mode goes to uh, studio series. So, but yeah, and I wish they would have gave her two katanas. Recommendation three out of five. I'm gonna give her a recommendation three out of five. Actually, I'm gonna give her two recommendations. Three out of five in robot mode, four out of five in, in vehicle mode. Or I might give a strong five out of five in vehicle But no, I give a four out of five vehicle mode because I think they could have went over the paint, uh, the same, make the color of the paint throughout the whole car. If y'all can find her, they are. She is showing up in Walmarts. Um, so go, get down to Walmart and get her if you really, really want to get her. All right, folks. In the words of Optimus Prime, to all of one, and as I say with that, yes, we are need to be, we need to come together as one. All right, then, as I always say, folks, God is good all the time, and all the time, God is good. TNT Neon Prime out, y'all be blessed. Oh, and I love y'all, and thank y'all for watching. All right, now.